All right, welcome to a long time ago. Just a long time ago today because Martin's not with me. Um, I'm heading out to a toy fair. It's uh, Andy's Totten Toy Fair. You might remember this one from our Southampton video that we did at the very start of the year. It was the first Totten Toy Fair of the year and today I'm going to the last one of the year. Uh, so I'm gonna see what they've got. It'll be the second time that I've been. Um, and it's normally the usual stuff from, from those two experiences so far. It's always been, you know, similar sort of things, but I want to see what's about as it's the last one of the year. I'll check it out. Uh, I'm going to get the um, early bird tickets for this one to see if I can avoid the crowds. So that means I think it's 9.30 uh, opening time. I'm already a little bit late. Um, but I think the rest of the crowds are let in at about 11 so I'll have an hour and a half hopefully where it's a bit quieter and I can get some good footage but we'll see um, it's not very big you might remember if you've seen our Southampton video it's not very big but there's normally some pretty good stuff in it so yeah let's go This is Andy, this is his toy fair. How long have you been doing? Uh, this one, I've been doing a show since uh, uh, August last year. Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah. I came, we came to the January one this year. Yeah. I came to one just before that. And yeah, this will be my third time. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, it's um, 10 times a year. 10 times Yeah, yeah. it's just uh, the, in May and December we don't have one. Right. Yeah. yeah. Any reason for me? Uh, yeah, we go somewhere else. Oh, yeah. It's a, okay. a, a thing called Lawless. Oh, right. To do a Judge Dread 2K's oh, and AD. Right. Okay. Yeah, and that's, that's a real passion. Nice. Yeah, yeah that's cool. Well, thanks cool. for putting the nice show on. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. We have it on Blu ray as well.
That's it. I that's can't feel my fingers. First one, isn't it? Yeah, it's the it's first. Yeah, it's the first release. Yeah. Yeah. No, the little clicker's gone. No click. No click. Marcus, how easy are the clickers to fix? Are they? Okay. You just unscrew it. You got to unscrew them at the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but the best thing is, his dome. His dome's nice and, and shiny, sticker. isn't it? The and his sticker's, sticker's not too bad. Really good. They saw the, uh, they've got the sensor scope in here as well. Yeah, yeah, I've found um, the sticker's a little bit nicer on the sensor scope, but the dome on that one's definitely nice. His dome's really nice. Yeah. What's that one in there? Oh, yeah, there's all sorts in there. I was going to go on too. That might be a, that might be the droid one. Yeah, yeah, it's a droid factory there too. Oh, yeah. 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 It's got a lovely sticker. Normally that sticker's minging. Yeah. His dome's pretty good. Yeah, he's a very nice one too. Wow. What what sort of price do you do on that one? Um, it'd be, un, it'd be 150. Is he? Yeah. 150? Yes. Wow. Yeah, in that sort of condition. Yeah, yeah. All right. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, yeah. Is it two, yeah, two, yeah. yeah. so there it is that's um andy's tot and toy fair uh yeah loads of really really cool things there it's actually um there was quite a sort of bigger mix than i remembered when we both went back in january what did you think yeah i mean you showed me the footage and uh i have to say the uh, first thing that jumps out is yeah you have to get early bird tickets um, I think yes. just like everything else. It was else. way quieter. Yeah, it, it, but then I even, I must have been sort of still there, gone 11 o'clock, mm -hmm. and I was speaking to Andy towards the end, and he said, like, it's probably the quietest one they've had so far. Oh, yeah. So I don't know if that was down to the weather or yeah. whatever time of year. But I don't know. There was a lot of stuff there, and I thought it would made made for some pretty good Christmas presents, you know, if people are looking. Yeah. So. Yeah, no, but, I mean, it did look, yeah. it looked great, and I think you're definitely right. When we went, was it January we went? I think it was. I think it was yeah. last weekend of January. I think it yeah. was, yeah, because February was um, Echo Base, wasn't it? Echo. So, yeah, it was. So, yeah, it was January. Put it out before that, mm. and it was, mm. it was really packed in there. So I don't think we sort of got to see everything there because the tables were so yeah. the rams that you know you kind of yeah. just had to pop your head over. So it, it must have been nice to sort of have a look around. Have a good look yeah. yeah um to be honest i don't think he was doing the early bird back then to that sort of level he did an early bird where you could get in at 10 i think mm. or half 10 yeah. um but yeah he's done an extra early bird now on this oh, one right. so yeah could, could get in at half nine yeah. i mean i saw some of the um chat you had with him and i don't know if you've added that actually in the footage mm -hmm. but um he, he said that they do them was it 11 months out of the 12 months a year Ten, oh, ten. ten months. Yeah. Yes, he said he doesn't do May and he doesn't do December. December, that's right. So yeah. that, so that was the last one of the year that I just went to. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, um, yeah it was, if you're in the area, it was really I would good. hardly suggest going. I'm sure you'd agree with yeah. that. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Um, I'll I'll tell you all more about it a little bit later. But I actually want to ask you a question, uh, Martin, because you uh you went to a toy fair, didn't you, Martin? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I did. I I was when we, when I was at Sandown and I was chatting with Stu, um, Universal Toy Collector Stu, and I was saying, oh, it's it's so annoying that around my area you never have toy fairs. Ne nothing yeah. you know nothing at all really and that weekend i, I was flicking through um instagram and i saw new market toy fair and i was like yeah. oh this is amazing this is going to be epic i can't wait this is going to be brilliant <laughs> straight online bought early bird tickets for 11 11 o'clock oh. entry um I got yeah. one for steph and one for me um you know got up in the morning i was really excited all morning to get there i, I couldn't wait I, I even put it on instagram that i you know the advert for the toy fair thinking oh this is going to be yeah. big <laughs> anyway <laughs> exciting I, times yeah yeah it was, yeah, it was gonna be great you know I, I i did some video footage of me driving to new market and a little intro in the car i got steph to film for me um i, I think i got it about take 38 but you know, I was going to say any corpsing on that one. I, yeah, I, I did. I did loads. I might Actually. still have the footage, but I don't think we'll put that yeah. on. Um, but yeah. so yeah, so I arrive in Newmarket, which isn't. It's only about twenty minutes from me, so it was a nice short drive. Walked up mm. the high street, walked to the the big hall that it was in, walked into the door, um, or through the door, I should say, and um, <laughs> into the actual hall. 
there was seven tables in there. <laughs> I mean, literally, and they weren't big tables. There were seven tables with massive gaps between them. Um, oh, no. <laughs> three of which just sold Pokemon cards. Um, yeah. One was selling printed T-shirts that you could order, and they would print the T-shirt and send it to you. Another yeah. one had um, like soft toys, teddy bears, that sort of stuff on. Um, and, and there was... There was one other table that was a bit like the sort of thing you'd expect from a toy fair where it had some He-Man, some Action Force, yeah. that sort of stuff. Um, had a couple of modern, loose Star Wars figures, but nothing that would interest me. And I think yeah. Steph and I, from the moment we walked in through the door and then walked back out the door, was probably about 90 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to say something like 10 minutes, no. but no. No, it was 90, <laughs> 90 seconds. seconds. Um, yeah. It was really disappointing. And, and it really, oh, wow. really, I really wouldn't suggest going to that unless they pull their finger out for the next one. Yeah, up up their game a little yeah. bit. Yeah. But let's stop talking yeah, about that because people want to no. hear about a good toy fair. Yeah, yeah. So, Tot and Toy Fair. Now, that is every Sunday of the month, like, um, like we said, but um, not for December or May. Uh, so yeah, if you are in the Southampton area, I heartily recommend you get to it if that's your sort of thing because it's it's really good. And Andy seems like a proper good dude. That's, I mean, we spoke to him a little bit, didn't we, mm. um, before? Mm. Um, but that was the first time I sort of introduced myself and told him what we were doing and stuff. And yeah, he's he seemed really really good guy and had. Well, you saw the amazing collection of figures he's got. Oh, the loose Kenner about, figures, of yeah. Those. A million, oh, wasn't there? So many. Yeah. He said he's just got so many, but he he was saying like his he gets a certain amount. You know, he, he'll he'll go to a certain level of beta. <laughs> if it's too mashed up, he's not he's not interested. Yeah. But yeah, he must have so many at home that he just sort of brings across each yeah. time. And it's it, along with so much more as well. Yeah. You know, I mean, it, it, when we see you off, often see now, don't we? Because we've been going to a lot of toy fairs over the last year. These huge piles of these vintage Star Wars figures, absolutely hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands, sometimes. And it just makes yeah. you realise how many were produced back in the day. Yeah. Um, it, yeah. You know, you don't get that anymore, do you? It's um, no, that's right. Know, the popularity of them and, were just second to none. Yeah, yeah, and I must have seen uh, five or six original Boba Fett's mm. you know and I mean sadly none of them had uh, weapons with them no. and that's that's what sort of makes them valuable really isn't it yeah. so yeah they because they, um, they're one of the most played with figures as well I think they always ended up looking like they've been played with as well yes yeah yeah, yeah. there's not a lot of green you, you've really got to check out that paintwork haven't you mm, absolutely really, yeah. you know cast a fine eye over it but but um there were a f there was loads of other things there not just star wars you know and a few of them that i wanted to mention there was a count duckula oh, figure did you see that i did i love and, count I love until count i saw duckula. that yeah so did i until i saw that though i completely forgotten it was a thing oh wow you know and i saw that and i was like oh i remember count duckula yeah. so good was that david jason he was yeah the i was thinking because yeah. he did danger mouse as well didn't he He did danger mouse as well yeah um, i didn't realize they had action figures of him i yeah. should have bought it i don't know why i didn't it was in really good nick yeah maybe, maybe next time but... i would have bought that yeah yeah <laughs> would you yeah i think i would have done if i'd seen it yeah yeah there was um yeah teenage mutant ninja turtles which i've said before was like my mm. thing when i was when i was a kid yeah. you know star wars was your thing yeah you know that was that was mine, and I'm always tempted. I'm always tempted by the Ninja Turtles, but a bit. I don't know. One day I've I've got you know this is my mission at the moment is to get the Star Wars stuff. Um, Jurassic Park was there. Loads of Action Force stuff, which you know until starting this again it was something I'd not really heard of or didn't remember as a kid. Yeah. So, but I know it's pretty popular. Um, yeah, and what was the, uh, what was the other thing? Oh, the Back to the Future cards. Now, you see the Back to the Future hover card, you know, a hover, hoverboard yeah, card, yeah. and I love it. I think it's brilliant. Yeah. I've I've had my eye on that for about a year now yeah. in various places. So I asked the guy how much it was, and bear in mind it was in very good condition, and he said eighty quid. Oof. Now I think that's quite a, quite a lot. Yeah. Um, I don't. It won't be know, vintage like, mm, either. It'll I, be quite modern. I'll, I'll be leaving that. Yeah, yeah. I'll be leaving that one because I'm sure I've seen it around for mm. thirty, mm. maybe even less. I don't know. But 
don't really know what the value is of these things. No. Like, I'm starting to gain an idea with the Star Wars stuff, you know, vintage collection and the old 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 school stuff. But yeah, with with you know, when I'm veering away to that sort of thing, I'm going to need a bit more advice. I think. Yeah. So. Well, yeah. when when um when we visit Florida on holiday, we go to Universal Studios and have a little store there that has loads of Back to the Future stuff. Um, yeah. They've actually got the full size hoverboards that you can buy. Um, oh, that would be you, you so know, cool! They've got this really you know expensive stuff like the flux capacitor you can buy and the, the, even the yeah. board where you input the dates and everything, all the way down to you know action figures. So I, I didn't realize yeah. um, you'd be interested in that sort of thing. So next time we go, I'll. Um, I'll oh, I mean, I love Back to the Future. Yeah. Who doesn't? Yeah, well, yeah, it's, it's a true, a true, amazing trilogy. Yeah, so, good. so yeah, um, yeah, yeah, I'll have to keep an eye out so, for you. Yeah, yeah. That's um, well, I don't know if I can afford to be getting a hoverboard anytime soon. So. <laughs> That's what we really want. Yeah. But, if it was real, yeah, so <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like I say, a, a great mix of things. Mm. You know, something for everyone there. So, get yourself down there yeah. if you can. So, if I, you're in the area, I, I, I guess, I guess, totally worth it. I guess the question that you know anybody who's watching this by now is like, did he pick anything up? Yeah, yeah. Well, I did this time. I haven't <laughs> in many recent times. So I've got these stickers. I can't quite see them from here. <laughs> That's not what you're expecting, is Panini. it? Panini. Um, Panini Toxic toxic Crusaders. Oh, right. I don't know anything about this. That yeah. They were giving these away as you went in. They gave you a pack. Okay. I don't know. It says they're from 1991. Oh, right. I've never but heard of them. I have no recollection of them at all. No. But really, that's that's not what we're here for, is it? Let's have a look at this little guy. I think you all know what it's going to be. But it's oh, so I went for this. It's not the uh, sensor scope. Oh, of course, that focusing. I went for the original solid. first. Yeah, solid dome. Solid dome. Oh wow! Yeah. See, so you, you didn't. It, it, it was that the one that doesn't click. We fixed it. There's there's not much of a click no. there. It's a slight click, yeah. but nothing much. Oh, that's really so cool. I will have a go at fixing it. Yeah. But this guy, you know, it's it's in pretty good nick. Mm. It's in pretty good nick, considering how old it is. Yeah. Um, I'm tempted to put pictures up and see if people have an idea of what grade he will make yeah. on the off chance yeah. that I send it away. We'll flash it up on honest. the screen, um, you know, as yeah, we're doing I'll this. I'll put up yeah. a few pictures now yeah. and then, yeah. Let us know in the comments what you think that might make. That's really cool. He's, he's all right, yeah. Yeah, because uh, so so he didn't go for the um, Droid Factory one then. No, 150 quid was a little bit outside <laughs> my uh, <laughs> outside my budget. Yeah, I thought but, so. And to be honest, I didn't even ask about the um, sensor scope. I didn't ask how much it was. No. And I kind of wish I had now because I should have really gotten both. Mm. But, yeah. There'll be another chance, yeah. I'm sure. So, so you're kind of starting a, a loose loose collection now, aren't you? That'll be your second one. <laughs> yeah, that's and, my second one. I don't know about that. And I think we'll I see. think Obi Rob Kenobi's just completed your. He, he's, he's offered to help yeah, you out, kind yeah. enough to help me out with the um the staff of Admiral Akbar. Yeah. Well, I say staff. Yeah. It's not staff, is it? The stick. Yeah. Well, yeah. You know. <laughs> so come yeah, on, that's stick. really good. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So yeah. So um, cool. Amazing. Yeah. yeah so but two that's, two that's down, ninety four to go. 94. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Excellent. Right. Well, that is it for this week. Um, I hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, if you did, please hit that like button and the subscribe button if you aren't subscribed already. And we'll catch you in the next one. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye.